2018 was our best performing year ever. And when it comes to entertainment, they don't come much bigger than Ireland's Got Talent. Uh, we set the bar high last year, but now we've really supersized the show. Glenda like gave birth. Yeah. And then joined Live on telly. Index. Actually, that's part of one of the acts. Glenda gets better on stage. It's Her amazing. stomach is better than mine. Yeah. And Glenda's legs have got talent. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, you can expect a much bigger and better show than last year. Um, obviously people with lots of talent, people with not so much talent, but they're entertaining. It was the summer of love or the summer of Love Island. Um, we had over ten and a half million streams alone of Love Island Ireland. And each episode, if you look at all platforms, was watched by almost four hundred thousand viewers. So it was an amazing performance. It's not a couple's retreat, it's a dating show. So you've got to be honest with yourself whether it gives you a negative opinion or not, and that's why we found our success. Box Office Season 4 is coming back and I'm so psyched. It's going to be a great one this season because we're kicking off with a trip to New York City. Louis rehearsed over at Westlife. <laughs> he's rehearsed over the gigs at Westlife. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, he's, he's, he's out shopping he's, for stores. He's replacing Brian McFadden. Louis hates us. Louis hates us. Louis hates everything about us. Trying to make me look fit. There's a lot of husband, wife acts, um, father and daughter. They're all the good ones. Even the most casual sports fan is recognising that what we're seeing at the moment from Ireland is historical. Last year was pretty much the greatest year for an Irish rugby team ever. 